Assalamualaikum, my name is Adam Esaburiza This is our group project Smart Safety Cafe And today I'm going to show you our demo for our project Okay, this is our, first I want to show you our sensor Okay Okay, from where you can see For this space After the car that has run over the speed limit it will show the display on the monitor and also give a uh, bus warning to the pedestrian this is uh, this show that uh, this is very good because some people that has disability that can hear or cannot see if people that, that, that cannot see they can hear the buzzer that means they can warning they are upcoming in the uh, high speaker and then if they are cannot hear they can see the display that which is they can show that there's an upcoming incoming uh, high speaker and then from here this is uh, what the normal if uh, they're gonna show if the, the car is slow or not. Okay, from we, from we can see it's only 16.9 km per hour, so it's gonna not gonna buzzer, gonna turn on, so that means the car is already driving in the safety speed limit. Okay, now I'm gonna show you our database for the input that we get from the speed sensor. From here, we can see. This is the speed, and then from here you can see. Now I'm going to show you again. See, we can get input from our sensor to send to our database. Database, so we get uh, we can get the from this chat. We can see the daily speed of user in like uh, right now is last hour within that one hour. How many people they are the bus pass by our speed detector? And we can see that people are driving more than 100 km, and we can also see the flow of the chart or the speed our daily user okay, now I'll show you our uh, smart pedestrian okay, so smart traffic light card to action so this second is our subsystem which is smart traffic light we are using motion sensor as our detector to use the pedestrian traffic light first we are using the we are using toy as our sensor Right now we are using sensor that they can detect So pedestrian can just walk, don't need to touch button to open, to use the traffic for the pedestrian walk And then from here we can see, this is our database, we can see how many people are using the traffic light And this is our chart for how many people are using the car light in our And we can also put in a month from this uh, database user can see the daily user from the apps itself. Okay. 